Hi, I'm Cecilia. I'm going to introduce you our brand new wireless conference system, EshareW90. And in the first part, we're going to see how to share your screen with EshareW90. And in the second part, we're going to see how to hold a hybrid meeting with it. If you are interested in our product, we also put unboxing and setup guide at the end of the video. So let's get started. Azure W90 has two HDMI outputs and connects up to two monitors. One supports up to 4K 60Hz and another up to 4K 30Hz. You can have a dual view like this and you also can have a quadruple view for a single monitor setup. For the screen sharing, you can have wide options. You can share with an HDMI or a USB-C port. Just plug into the device you want to share. It's pretty simple. Or you can share your screen wirelessly. You can use a wireless dongle like eShare D20 or eShare D30. And for the first time, you need to pair with your eShare W90. Just plug it into the USB-C port on the front panel and wait until it sets on the screen paired successfully. Okay, now it's paired successfully and plug it to the laptop you want to share. Wait until the light stays on. And now you can click the button and your screen is shared successfully. That's it. Here is a small trick. If you want to post your sharing for privacy purpose, you can just double click the button and now your screen movement will be kept just to yourself. And when you are ready to share again, you can click this button again. Each W90 can connect up to 30 dongles at a time. And if you have multiple presenters in the meeting, you can just plug the dongle into your device. So you are ready to share whenever you want, just in one click. And W90 will switch to the newly connected source automatically. You can share by Miracast or AirPlay too. And if you share by Miracast, make sure your Wi-Fi is on and choose eShare W90. You can share your screen fast and easy. You can use AirPlay too and make sure your device and W90 are in the same network. You can use eShare W90 Wi-Fi or you can use the office network where W90 is into and after use the screen mirroring feature to connect to W90. And now your screen is cast on the display. Screen sharing is smooth and easy with eShare W90. It's built with the auto upscaler making it more compatible with different devices. The meeting room system is already set up and let's see how to use eShare W90 to hold a wireless hybrid meeting. For the wireless dongle, you can use eShare D20. No driver is needed, totally plug and play. Or you can use eShare D30. You will need to install a driver the first time you connect to your device. I'm gonna use eShare D30 and I have already paired it before so I don't need to do it again and I plug it to the laptop. We need to install the driver and the application will pop up automatically. Just click this and to start the setup. If you don't find the pop-up, you can find it in the PC or you can download it from our website. Now the driver is installed. You can click this button to share your screen and you can click this small button to start to host and the connected USB devices like room camera and speakerphone will be available. I just opened a Zoom meeting and I can use them as my meeting room microphone, speakerphone and camera. My meeting is ready now and I'm gonna invite my colleague John to join me. Hi John, how are you? Uh, hi Cecilia. Very nice. Good to see you. 
How are you today? And I'm nice and we are shooting for Isher W90 and uh, I'm using Anico V8 and M1. Can you see me and hear me clearly? Yes, the call is quite good. Well, that's nice. I'm happy to do the demo video and show our clients what the product can do. Yeah, yeah. Thanks for joining us today and just for our audience to see how it works. And I'm gonna get back to the demo and we talk later. Yeah, good luck. Catch up later. Okay, thanks. Bye. You can also have multiple presenter. And Jackie is joining me now. And if he wants to share his screen, he can take another dongle and plug it, plug it into the laptop. Just wait a moment and press the button. And now his screen is shown on the display. And if he wants to host the meeting, he can press the small button. So now all the meeting room equipment will switch from my laptop to his computer. And with Isher W90, it's easy for everyone to engage and share in the meeting. Except wireless dongle, you can also use cables to hold your meeting. If you have a in-room PC, you can connect it via an HDMI and a USB cable. You can also use a USB-C cable, plug it to your laptop, and you can have the control over this meeting room system. This USB-C cable also charges your laptop and provides you with wired connection. An Isher W90 has two LAN ports. You can separate your guest network from your internal network to protect your company's data. So these are the main features of Isher W90. If you want more information, feel free to contact us. See you later. Now I'm going to unbox the Isher W90 and walk you through the quick setup. Let's see what's in the package. The Isher W90 wireless conferencing system, one HDMI 2.0 cable, one USB-C cable, one USB-A to B cable, a power adapter, three power pins, mounting brackets with screws, and a product menu. The wireless dongle is sold separately. Both Isher D20 and D30 work with W90. The D20 is plug and play with no driver needed, while the D30 supports wireless conferencing after a quick installation of the eShare app. Let's see how to set up. Now we have the eShare W90, wireless dongle, a webcam, two microphones, two meeting room displays, and two HDMI 2.0 cables. Let's do it in six steps. Fetch two HDMI 2.0 cables and connect both displays to the W90's HDMI out ports. Hook up the USB-C cable to the W90, then hook up the HDMI and USB-C host cable to the W90. Connect the meeting room webcam to the hub, then connect the microphone to the room webcam. You can daisy chain another extended mic to the first one for a better pickup range. Connect two network cables to these two LAN ports. Then connect W90 to local network via the utility LAN port. The security LAN port can be used either to provide network access for a laptop or to connect to another local network for security. Use the power adapter to plug it in. As the light on the front panel turns green, the power is on. Everything is set now. If you use the wireless dongle for the first time, don't forget to plug it into the USB-C port on the front panel to quickly pair it with your Isher W90. 